Shout out to the KHA fam and you're rocking with Kristen and Jamia. And we're back, you guys, for another mukbang. Woo! But not just any mukbang. What? You guys, today we're doing a very special Taco Bell mukbang. It is a sad day, you guys. Everything you have in front of us <laughs> is going away. Going away. We are doing a farewell to the Mexican pizzas. Yes. We're doing a farewell to shredded chicken. We didn't just want to eat shredded chicken by itself, so we got it in a soft taco. <laughs> and the, we're saying goodbye to pico de gallo, which we poured on top of the Mexican pizzas. Yes. Yeah, you guys, it's a sad day. Three items. I know. Uh, Some of our friends posted a little post saying that these were going away, and so we were like, all right, well, we got to do a video on this because and we know, we Mexican, know how many people. And we know Mexican pizzas are people's favorites. Yes. Hasn't been our favorites, but <laughs> but these actually look really good today. Today? Yeah. So we are actually thumbnailed off screen. Uh -huh. uh, we're going to let our uh, fan members fam members choose what yes. thumbnail we use. So we're just going to get it in now. Exactly. And just a little I'm bit excited. of a, a, a background behind that, just so you guys know. Yeah. Uh, for those of you who haven't heard, we have a supporter slash membership page going on right now, guys. Program. Uh, program, I should yeah. say. Yes. <laughs> Uh, if you notice down below, there's probably a button if you're on Facebook that says support now. Mm -hmm. If you're on YouTube, below it says join. Uh, that's something that we have going, uh, and we could talk about it a little bit more later. But ultimately, we're doing a membership-only lives, membership-only contests, mm -hmm. membership-only polls and voting and deciding on what we eat and, yeah. sets and things like that. Yeah. Thumbnails are one of those things as well. So if you're so, interested, feel free to click If you want to join, click the button below to learn more. Yes. Everybody who's a supporter now, thank you so much. We uh, appreciate you. Absolutely. Thank you all. Okay, okay, let's say goodbye to this Mexican pizza. Let's do it. Okay, we've never had it like this, guys. We've never had it look this good. Yeah, we haven't. That's facts. Normally, when we get it, it looks sad. It looks really sad. It looks like it was made without love. But these look really good today. They do. And I know it's a lot of you guys' favorite uh, foods and from mm. um, Taco Bell. I get you guys like the Mexican pizza. And to be honest, yeah. I like it. Huh. Huh. <laughs> huh. I'm not like a... I'm not like a huge fan of it. I like it. It's good. You don't it's like good. the beef. That's why. The the beef and the tostada combo of those two are just not. Oh, you know what it is? Mm -hmm. It's the beans too. Oh, it's the beans. refried beans mm -hmm. with the tostada. I think that's really my, my biggest issue with that. Yeah. Okay. Don't get me wrong. I can eat it. I like it. It's just not my favorite from Taco Bell. I'm going to give you facts right now. Okay, here we <laughs> go. Let's hear it. No, I agree. Um, I actually, to be honest, I, I don't love the tostada thing either. Oh, you're copying me. Are those the facts you're going to give? <laughs> it has a weird texture. Mm -hmm. um, but today they're actually made really well. Mm -hmm. Just so you know, we have nacho cheese to dip it in and creamy jalapeno sauce. Mm -hmm. Those are not going away. Thank mm -hmm. goodness. Because the creamy jalapeno sauce is where it's at. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. What were you gonna say? I was gonna say it's it is strange that the uh, the pico de gallo is going away. And pico de gallo. I'm assuming no one got it. That's mm -hmm. the only thing I can think of. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. I mean, you were saying maybe that yeah. people just didn't buy it, uh -huh. or they didn't know that they had it. Maybe right? I think a lot of people didn't know that you could get a side of pico. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. By the way, I got my ice drink right here. It's a classic lemonade. Which, I'm going to say it's good, but that's not the best. <laughs> Wouldn't call it classic lemonade. And I just have water. <laughs> mm. um, but yeah, so it's it's crazy that they, oh. they're, I think what, the, I wonder if they're like revamping themselves, Taco Bell. I think they constantly are. Here, here's my, okay, look, I have, listen. You have a theory? It's not that hard of a theory, yeah. <laughs> Let's hear it. Okay, pico de gallo. Here we go. When pe listen, people get the hot sauce. Okay. They get this. Yes, they do. When they get hella sides of it. I don't know a lot of people that order hella sides of pico. Not saying you guys don't. I'm sure some do. Yes. But the majority of people are always trying to get these packets versus pico. Okay. Also, I don't think they put pico de gallo in that many of the products. Mm -hmm. I think you can get things al fresco, and I think they put pico in mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. Who gets things al fresco? I mean, yeah. a few people. Not a lot. I guess my point is... To, to manufacture it, to make it, it's probably not a big seller. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm also going to go with the shredded chicken. They're getting rid of shredded chicken. Mm -hmm. Same thing. I mean, at least I don't get a lot of things with shredded That's chicken true. in it. No, me neither. If any. Or you got the beef and the steak, mm -hmm. you know? So mm -hmm. I don't think I've ever tried. I take the back. I know I've had the shredded chicken, but it's been years. Yeah. But I do have to say, the Mexican pizza. 
I know that's popular. So, I don't have a theory on that. Exactly. So my theory, because Kristen doesn't know, I think I know. <laughs> no, but I think what they do, what they're doing is revamping. Because think about it, right? Like they don't have, um, they got rid of all the stuff, like so many different things. Not good. The shredded chicken. Is that why it's gone? <laughs> Gotta try it. <laughs> okay, I'm trying. Is it shredded it. chicken or is it beef? <gasps> this is beef. Oh, it's beef. Maybe that's why. Taco Bell. Okay, we didn't get shredded chicken. Come on, guys. We asked for it. No, no, no. This is. Is it? That's shredded chicken. Oh my god, it looks like beef. It does. Oh, it is shredded chicken. Oh, maybe they put both in here. Mm-hmm. Regardless, I had a bite of something and it is not good. Mm-mm. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, if there was a trash next to me, that'd go right there. Mm -hmm. What is that? It's the chicken. It's shredded chicken. Taco you know? Bell, get rid of your shredded chicken today. <laughs> Don't wait. Don't no deadlines. <laughs> Yeah. Stop that. You're good. I shredded chicken's going away in November. That, that was disgusting. It's it's the most nasty <laughs> thing I've ever had. You can get rid of that today. Facts. Cut it loose today. Facts. Don't wait. No one's going to miss it. Oh my gosh. Because we never eat shredded chicken. I don't think I've ever had that before. Oh. <laughs> that was all bad. So. Uh, okay. I agree with you on why they're getting rid of that. Yeah. <laughs> like. Oh. That's no one's nasty. probably eating that. That's nasty. But um, but they got rid of so many other things. Mm -hmm. uh, a couple weeks ago, we did a, a live where we had all the things that were discontinuing. Yes. And it was like it was good things. Seven or eight things, maybe mm -hmm. even nine. Mm -hmm. And they were good things. So mm -hmm. I'm assume I have a feeling that they're revamping. Totally. I could be wrong. Mm. But Taco Bell does that. Uh, not discontinue, but they revamp. You know, from time to time. You know. I don't mind this. Mexican pizza. It's just mm -hmm. I'm eating it. Mm -hmm. Obviously. <laughs> mm. Are you sure you're eating it? It's just not great. Yeah. 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 I'm not a big fan of refried beans. Mm -hmm. Not in everything. I like it in burritos for sure. I love it in burritos. Mm -hmm. Um. I can have a little bit of it in tacos, but maybe sometimes. And you know, I take that back. I can have it in a tostada. Like if you if you have an egg and and you know bacon or something in that, I can eat that. But I don't know what it is. I'm not a big. It's I'm not a huge fan of it on these Mexican tacos. Uh huh. Are you but, mean the Mexican pizzas? No, on a tostada. What did I say? You said Mexican taco. Yeah, Mexican pizzas. <laughs> Yeah. Kristen's been messing up names lately, you guys. Yeah, no. A lot. <laughs> Jamil does it all the yeah. time lately. <laughs> I've been doing it for a long time. Yeah. So. But it's just, yeah. Anyways. I'll be honest. Mm -hmm. I'm sad that taco was awful. I know. I'm a little sad that's awful. Maybe have another bite with something else in it. What do you mean? Put like the nacho cheese in it. On the Mexican pizza or the taco? No, the taco. Yeah, no. <laughs> You're not even giving it a second That's chance? That's not how you do it. Uh, no. I'm not giving it a second chance. Oh my God, it's it over. so bad. <laughs> it was really bad. <laughs> I think also... Yeah. I think about the Mexican pizzas... I don't want to talk smack about it because I know a lot of people like it, but it doesn't no. make me want... Be respectful, Kristen. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't make me want more of it. Well, you know what I mean? I mean, yeah. Like, if I usually have, like, a burrito and it's, like, really good, I want, like, two, you know? But it depends. It's, a, it's yeah. I feel you. I think it's it's a flavor thing. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. It's to each your own, essentially, right? Yeah. So you don't like the flavor on it? You don't like the flavor? I think the texture of those tostadas are not hitting for me. Mm. And, yeah, the flavor isn't fabulous. It's okay. If the tostada were, were harder, mm -hmm. would that be better for you? Probably. I feel you. So yeah. it's like soggy. A little bit, yeah. Like, like a little crunchier, I think I prefer. Yeah, but it's fine. Mm -hmm. It's the best thing out of that shredded chicken. Yeah, I know, right? Negative two. <laughs> Negative two. Uh, yeah, that shredded chicken. But there's Mexican bad. pizzas, I give like a five, six, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. We're not going to lie, guys. We'll be okay with it being gone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but here's the deal. Here's the thing I did want to say. Mm -hmm. We got it. For a couple reasons. One, I've only had it 
maybe two other times. Uh One of the other times was, didn't we get it last week? Or two weeks ago. On a video? On a video. We had it. And it was all messed up. It was all messy and just like didn't look good. Uh Uh-huh. So I knew for sure. I'm like, all right, well, I definitely want to try it again. Mm -hmm. And this time it looks good. I am actually appreciative because there's way more cheese on it this time. Yeah. Last time was like a little, it was like a drizzle of cheese. Yeah. On one side. And I went to the side. I'm like, what's going on? They did us dirty on the last one. They really did. They They did way better now. Yeah. So if I if I had a higher standard, I would have went back. But I didn't know. I thought that was how they made them all. <laughs> I bet you instead yeah. of beef, if you got steak, it would have been better. You'd probably really like these vegetables. I agree. I agree. We might have to try them with steak before they discontinue them. Yeah, that's true. Uh, actually, I should try them out. But you guys yeah. run out, and if you get get you some Mexican pizzas because they're going away, mm-hmm. skip on the shredded chicken, please. I know, right? Well, we're doing you a favor. <laughs> I'll be honest. But, yeah. I've never loved shredded chicken. Well, there's you, some people out there that love shredded chicken. You mean from anywhere? Is anywhere. What you're saying. I'm not a shredded chicken fan. Okay. Have you? What about having them like on tacos or? Well, I don't obviously. prefer it because I always have found shredded chicken to be bland. Um, not saying mm. every shredded chicken's bland. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You that's like shredded true. chicken? I do. That's why not he, more than. That's why he gets it all the time. Well, that's what I was saying. <laughs> I never get it. <laughs> exactly. So you can't but, say that. No, but I do like it. Uh huh. It. I'm just saying. It depends on where you get it from, because I've gotten it plenty of times. Remember Lucinda's? It was bad there. It was not good there. That's what they're known for. No, it was not good there. I've had it at other places, and it's way better. It was not good there. Oh. I did that's not like it. That's like people's favorites: shredded chicken burritos no. from Lucinda's. No. No. Uh, let's look up the review of that place, by the way. Uh, I will. Because I, you know, here's the okay. thing. Okay. There's this place. Let's not get in a fight. Uh, we have to, okay. because <laughs> here's the deal. Okay, I'll look it up right There's now. this place in Mill Valley, guys, mm-hmm. and it's called Lucinda, and, and Lucinda's, and it's a Mexican restaurant, and it's really popular in Marin. Mm-hmm. I ate there for the first time when I first came to Marin. Yes. Uh, coming from it's Oakland, a few other places. It was, at best, okay. It's super popular, and they're known for the shredded chicken um, yeah. items. And it just wasn't anything special. Three and a half stars. Exactly my point. <laughs> and that's my point. And don't get me wrong, three and a half <laughs> isn't terrible. <laughs> it's just that when you have locals giving that 3.5, that says something. Three and a half's not awful. But three yeah, it should, bad. yes, if you're gonna, yeah. It should be four. It should be. Especially in California, like we're... Known for our Mexican restaurants and taquerias and stuff. Yes. So that's true. You know what I mean? So like I said. <coughs> <laughs> you don't like it? My dad loves mm-hmm. the shredded chicken. He does, huh? From there. He likes to sit I mean, Although he hasn't been there probably forever. But. Mm-hmm. I'm not saying that, you know, you can't like it. Mm-hmm. I just think that if you've had it from other places, it's way better. Right. It's way better mm-hmm. from certain places. Yeah. It just depends on the restaurant. There's no doubt about that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So how come you're not but eating more Mexican pizza? I did. I just had one. Oh, okay. Exactly. How come I, you're not eating more? Because I feel like you don't like it. Do you like it? Yeah, I'm okay. fine with it. I don't love it. I'll have one more. Listen, instead of complaining about me, <laughs> how about you think about you? I'll have okay? one more. It's not that bad, though. Yeah, it's good. It's fine. Um, so, you guys, it is 109 degrees currently right now outside. 109 degrees. Uh-huh. But we are so lucky. I have no idea why. But the heat is not really coming here. It's 79 right now outside. Which sounds hot. It does sound hot, but it's actually kind of cool. It's cool. But if you it's go outside, it is it's miserable. Ridiculous. 109. Then, I know. <laughs> and then we have right outside our door, I don't know what happened, but there's all these flies just lined up outside waiting to get in. In fact, I think I saw one land on Kristen's uh, uh, Mexican taco that she's eating right now, or Mexican uh, pizza that she's eating right now. <laughs> I can't eat when we're talking about that. <laughs> I'm just saying, watch it's out. Nasty. There's one that landed in Pula. <laughs> <Stop. laughs> okay. All right, I know I shouldn't be talking about that. Oh. Okay. There's these blanks beeps outside. <laughs> <laughs> and there then, is like an army of them outside that we're It's crazy. To get it. Yeah. It's crazy. Yeah. Anyways, but, but um, um, no, but I have to say, we live right by the coast. I mean, not right by, but yeah, what if, you we're know. close, we're close. What to are the we, coast. 10 miles from the coast, 20? Sure, not yeah. that far, yeah. Um, and, and it's on. normally you'll get like a sea breeze, but to get 109 right near the coast is pretty crazy, mm-hmm. yeah. We're not like in the debt, this is in Vegas, yeah, it's crazy, uh-huh. yeah. I mean, obviously, 
once again, if you're somewhere who lives in Vegas, we understand. We get no sympathy. <laughs> or Texas. No sympathy at all. Exactly. If you're Texas, mm-hmm. even Minnesota's hot, we get it. No minute, no, <laughs> no sympathy. But mm-hmm. for norm, normally, it's not supposed to be like this, guys. No. It's it's not supposed to be like this at all. The so. max is like 102 mm-hmm. usually, and that's a like a hot hot day. So and to then, be 109, I've never been 109 here. And then we're getting threats. Mm. Death threats. No, we're not. From PG&E. No. I'm not going to cut the power off in the middle of a heat wave. <laughs> that's actually we not true. Yeah. <laughs> yes. yeah. Our, our gas and electric company saying. is threatening to cut the power off. That's what they're saying. Because not only do we have to deal with heat, which we said before, we have to deal with wildfires where we're at lately, which is yes. like a new thing yep. for the past few years. And so they're threatening to turn off our power so nobody can get AC yes. in this heat. They, they want to make sure. You see, here's wanna, the thing. I, well, they'd get sued. That's why they haven't done it yet. People would be pissed if they cut it off. They'd get sued. Mm. Yeah. Well, well, see, I wonder about they that, would. right? Because you. Well, actually, I take that. I I agree with you because it's not just the AC. That's a, I mean, the AC is a problem. Sure, if it's 109 mm-hmm. and they cut it, that's terrible. But I think the biggest thing uh-huh. are are there a lot of people that um that are elderly that have machines. And they need power. I didn't think about that. You're 100% right. They need power. And if you cut that off, like, I don't care how many warnings you give. Facts. If you cut that off and that person's not prepared, that's terrible. Like, I think a lot of machines, I would think, run on both, like, electric and battery in case the electricity goes out. But that battery doesn't last forever. It doesn't last forever. No, it's dangerous. It really is. Yeah. It really is. So it's unfortunate to, to do that. And then, you know, last time they cut off there, there was no warning. They just... So anyways, we're getting threats from them. Okay, if it goes threats. off, Jamil and I are going in our car. <laughs> and we're going on a drive. We'll drive all around the Bay Area if we got it. We'll find electricity somewhere <laughs> and spend the night, you know? Because it is rough. Mm-hmm. Anyways. Yeah, no, it's crazy. So we hope you guys are cool. We hope yeah. you're enjoying some Mexican pizzas. Yeah. Um, and not enjoying the shredded chicken, no offense. And enjoy <laughs> the pico de gallo is good. I thought that was fine. Yeah. What's your favorite thing from Taco Bell? I forget. I get. Well, yeah, what do you normally get? That's actually a good point, right? I love on the dollar menu mm-hmm. the cheesy bean and rice burrito. That's it's right. one dollar, you guys, and yeah. it's hefty, it's hearty, it has refried hefty. beans, which I like the refried beans. Oh, you do. It's a vegetarian burrito, but it has refried beans, it has the rice, which the rice isn't that good, but mm-hmm. it's covered up with nacho cheese. Sure. And um, I believe a chipotle sauce. So it's like nacho cheese, a little rice, refried beans, uh, nacho cheese sauce. And then I get a side of cream and jalapeno sauce, and I Ooh. dip it, and it's delicious. So I get that. Not bad. And then I get the double stack tacos <laughs> that are also a dollar. Yeah. Um, and they are good. It has crunchy taco over a soft taco on the outside. And it's just regular taco with mm. you know lettuce and cheese. Okay. And beef. It's delicious. Nice. What's your favorite? I know what his favorite is. Well, let me tell you what so a man my, gets. Uh, what a man eats. Listen, calm down. <laughs> calm down. Listen. <laughs> my orders for Taco Bell are two dollars and some change. That's true. That's true. Two dollars and some change. Jamil comes out with nothing less than like a thirteen dollar order, and it irritates my soul. I was gonna say, let's the two dollars. You have two dollars and what twenty cents? You said it's like two dollars and eight cents. Or oh, eight cents, got or it. Or something. 13. Yeah, for me, you got to move the decimal over to the right. Yeah, <laughs> okay, tell me what you get, and it's not. Well, and what he gets isn't even that fab. Okay, go. listen, it's amazing. Okay, Boy, go. What do you get? Don't ever disrespect the uh, cheesy gordita crunch <laughs> with steak. I so I get I get two. Typically, I get like one or two. Cheesy gordita crunches, and I add steak. <laughs> I add steak to them because it just makes it amazing. It hits perfectly. He doesn't like it with beef. I do not like it with beef. Not that one. I also occasionally get the uh, like a chalupa. Mm-hmm. Occasionally get a chalupa with steak, but I can have that one with beef. Uh-huh. That one's not as bad, but I don't know. I can't do it with the cheesy gordita crunches. Uh-huh. I get that, and then I'll do like the quesadilla. By the way, with, exactly with steak. With steak. <laughs> exactly. Let's, let's be for real. <laughs> steak quesadilla. Steak quesadilla, which yeah. is incredible. Yeah. Do they, they normally come steak though, don't they? I think so. Now. Yeah, I think they I do. think before they weren't always, but yeah. Really? I don't think I've ever had it with beef. That's so interesting. Oh, no, no, not beef. I think it was like just Chicken. a quesadilla. Like back in the day, they was oh. like, it was just a quesadilla. 
No, I think they added the chicken quesadillas and steak quesadillas like later on. Got it, got mm-hmm. it, got it. Okay, that makes sense. That makes yeah. sense. Mm-hmm. And then um, what else do I get from time to From time to time, I'll get like the quesaritos. Um, I don't mind that's those. That's once in a while. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that one's a little rare. Uh, but that's that's pretty much it. I mean, but, for me, I would say the number one thing are the cheesy gordita crunches with steak. I think that's it for me. Each one of I'm those sorry. is like four dollars. I swear. Yeah. So they he gets are. a two four dollar taco. So it's eight bucks. I eat good. And then the quesadilla is like four bucks. So he's at like twelve or thirteen dollars. It's a lot. Life. It's a lot, and it's actually not cool. Luckily, I so offset much. with mine. <laughs> I know, I'm very too. proud of my order. It's only two things. <laughs> it's two dollars. Yeah. You know, if you want something kind of tasteless, you know, then I I, I go with Kristen's. You, you know I mean? like the like... double stacked crunch tacos. <laughs> it's decent. And you've had a bite of my cheesy bean and rice burrito. Have I? I don't even remember. You don't it. love it. But it's really good. No, I don't it's think good. so. <laughs> but I'm glad you like it. Well, listen, I, luckily good. that I am, what do you call it? What do you call it? I'm responsible for the... Economics in our relationship. For okay? getting that? Yeah, For $2, right. yes, well, I am. Well, we can go down the line. I'm sure we can think of stuff that you get that's way more than I do when we go out. Never. I can't think of it. Exactly. Right. <laughs> that's, is, no, no. is there? No. I'm cool. sure there is. I am a, I'm a low-maintenance woman, you guys. Take me Not on true. a date. I'll <laughs> give you a $2 meal. Not true. <laughs> Taco Bell meal. <laughs> no, we going to a real restaurant. <laughs> No, but isn't that true though? Even if we go to a real restaurant, I'm never ordering like, well, yeah, fish or you know steaks. Well, yeah, well, me neither. Both but, of us, actually, yeah. both of us. I think we're pretty cheap dates, which is nice. Yeah, I, we'll know. usually get something along like a sandwich or a burger type situation. That's which right. Which is usually cheaper. Exactly. I'll do salads once in a while, which are like a lot, which mm-hmm. is ridiculous. But the salads are expensive, huh? Yeah. It's all about the presentation. That's why. It is. Yeah. It's the presentation. So, you ate it all. I did. Okay. You haven't had yours. Mm, no. <laughs> uh-huh. I'm not sad about it. I'm waiting for you to eat yours. <laughs> I'm not sad about it. We're talking about how hungry you were. I was. Well, now's your opportunity. Oh, as soon as I had that bite of that taco. That ruined your taste? This grilled chicken taco. How about one more bite? No. <laughs> no, it is so bad. But I do mm-hmm. think they put beef in it also. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I think so too. I think I just added chicken instead of substituted it. That's true. The person making it was probably like, "Why do they want beef and trying to chicken?" I know. <laughs> so, that's gross. Anyways. Yep. So, anyways, guys, we um. We're sad. Are you sad? No. Oh. I'm okay. not sad over this. I was gonna say it's good. This one's okay. The other goodbye Taco Bell thing we did, where they were getting rid of eight items, mm. I'd say three out of the eight were good. I was more sad about that. Yeah, no, but there I get were it. like five items that needed to go. Remember the potatoes? Those potatoes were good. I thought they were good. With yeah, the cheese on it. Fiesta like? potatoes. Oh, they so they got rid of those. Yeah, those were good. Yeah, and then yeah. they got rid of my favorite that I used to always eat, which was the steak. Well, I didn't always eat it. Oh yeah, steak soft steak taco. Soft taco. Guess what, you guys? Mm-hmm. They could still make it for you. Oh yeah. They it's said just they have it. They really have... expensive. <laughs> it's really expensive. Is it? It was like five dollars. Remember? No. It was like four or something. Four something. Yeah. Of course. It was crazy. Going with your theme. <laughs> no. What is? What was it though? She just had to replace it with steak. It was the shredded chicken. Shredded oh. chicken taco. Or oh. Something like that. And she... Which is going away. <laughs> Which is going away. But I'm sure they can make it because they have the tortillas. They have. Yeah. You can so probably just say, just "Hey, yeah, I want to." Because so- yeah, are they getting rid of all the soft tacos now? Oh, I don't know. That's a good question. I feel like they are. I mean, they're probably not getting they rid of it, be. but maybe on the... I don't know what they're doing. They might be. They'll probably add some more, like, soft tacos on there or something. I don't maybe. know. Maybe. So let me say this, though. Um, mm-hmm. I was going to say, so this is my thing. Like, I hadn't gone to Taco Bell. Okay, so I, like... What happened? Like, I didn't go to Taco Bell for, like, seven or eight years. Like, a long time. When? Like, I had it, like, before... Way before we met. Oh. Yeah, like before for the K and J relationship era. Yeah, literally before all of that stuff, <laughs> I hadn't gone for like. It might have been like five years, or some some massive gap of time. I didn't go until mm-hmm. high school. Uh huh. Because we we our high school's right next to a Taco Bell. At the time, we were next to a Taco Bell. Oh no, actually, we were next to it, but the Taco Bell we went to was the one in Marin City. Oh. So I remember my friend was um, him and I would go to Taco Bell after school because he loved it. So I was like, yeah, let's let's go and get it. Mm-hmm. And I don't remember how I got it, but I got the steak soft taco. Uh-huh. And that, like, did it for me. That, like, brought me back you into Taco the Bell. You loved the steak soft taco. I used to get it 
every single time, and I would get like six of them. <laughs> I'd get a whole bunch of them. They were so good. I remember when we they used to so go there. You, oh, you love the steaks off dumplings. Love them. I think that's like all you got. Too. That was all I got. Yeah, you just, just got like three. A whole bunch of them. Yeah, yeah. maybe not six. I got like I got like three or four. Three yeah. or four a lot of uh-huh. times. But that's like all I got. I and love. I remember Jamil's like, eat it, like try it, it's really good. Yeah. And I remember eating really it, it was it. okay. <laughs> I needed it to be like a supreme. I needed the sour cream. And the, yeah, well and it had tomatoes. some type of sauce in it. I don't think it did. No, it did. Of, of course it did. We think they just put the sausage in there. Or not sausage, but just steak in the tortilla. Oh, okay. oh it did have a sauce. Yeah, it was like a, it, did it was like a sour cream-ish type of sauce. It was like a light Weird sauce. It yeah, was, I don't know what it was. Yeah, it was good though. It was it, it was, was good. so good. That's but true. Again, I think I ate it too much to the point where I'm just like, I don't ever want it again. He never now. had it again. Like we, he yeah, had it, it was like the for first years, couple like years year of our so. relationship. Yeah, and then. But then it's not like we went to Taco Bell all the time, right? We kind of stopped going again. I feel like we went pretty often. Yeah, but there's, we had time periods, right? Like We had gaps, yeah. Exactly. Gaps of time where we would go, and then we mm-hmm. wouldn't go, and then mm-hmm. we would go a lot, and it wouldn't go, so... That's true. Yeah, there were gaps of time, for yeah, sure. that's true. But all I know is... Oh, are you going to say something? Yeah. Go ahead. I was going to say, you guys, we lost some footage this... Week. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, as you know, which is why we had to postpone our li- our Sunday live to Monday. That's right. So yes. I blame Jamil. No. no, I was gonna say, don't blame me. That's <laughs> no, it's, it's no. I don't know what happened. It just happened. So, anyways, yeah. we had to redo some videos. So mm-hmm. uh, this is one of the videos, but it's fine. You yeah. know, it happens when you're a YouTuber. It sucks to lose footage. Yeah, that's like the worst thing you could do. That's um, a tough thing. Yeah, footage and audio is also mm-hmm. really bad. But audio. It happens. Yeah, I guess if you lose either one, you're messed up. Uh-huh. When you're recording, it's tough because, you know, we have a screen. We have our we're recording on our phone, obviously, so we can actually see mm-hmm. the time and stuff. But it just it just sucks when it when it does happen. Cause, yeah. Uh, you know, you never want to lose anything. You never do. You know. So I'll rehire you maybe later. Exactly. <laughs> if you play your cards right. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> sure. Yeah. I I think what we do is just run out of uh, storage yeah. on the phone and mm-hmm. then. But I don't know. I don't know what happened because Kristen said that because mm-hmm. I forgot. But after we recorded, I was looking at just like looking. He was looking at the it. video and it was fine. It's perfectly fine. It was like disappeared. But then when I went to go back to like put it on my computer, mm-hmm. it just wasn't there. The file was completely corrupt. Totally. So I don't know. I don't know what happened, guys. It sucks when you lose footage like mm-hmm. that. But you it know, is. it is what it is. Totally. You know. It was a good video too. It was a good video. It was so good. Maybe we'll redo it again. We're gonna have to, you guys. Yeah. We are. So sad. It was such a good video. It was the best video we ever, ever recorded. Calm down. Just keep it at that. I don't know Just keep it at that. Just trust me when I say, if you didn't like us before, you would have loved us after that video. So. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, I'm teasing. I'm teasing. Okay, so. you guys, we love you so much. We hope yes. you enjoy this. Let us know if you're going to run out and get a Mexican pizza or run That's out fine. and get some cheddar chicken or pico de gallo. Yes, absolutely. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Sharon is caring. Let your friends and family know what the K and J fam are doing. Absolutely. Until next time, guys, we hope you have a wonderful day, evening, or night, whatever time it is out there for you. And we will see you next uh, tomorrow, actually, for another video. Mm-hmm. Peace. Peace out, Trouts.